family history is absolutely a risk factor for heart disease. So if everyone in your family develops heart disease, you're obviously at higher risk of, of experiencing the same, um, the same you know, health, health issues. However, genetics is not destiny. Genetics is predisposition. And I think of genetics very much like the story of the three little pigs, right? Genetics are a blueprint. They're a blueprint instruction. Well, each one of the pig, little pigs got a blueprint instruction that said build a house. But the three little pigs used different materials to build their structures with very different results, right? So always build with bricks, not with straw. So even if the plans you've been handed are faulty, you can overcome that genetic predisposition by how you live. If you have a very strong family history of heart disease, it becomes really important to look after your risk factors. Know what your blood pressure is, know what your cholesterol is, your blood sugar, your weight. Make sure you're not smoking, right? Be physically active, like going back to all those modifiable risk factors that we have. Make sure that they are all optimized, right? And if you do that, the chance that your genetic predisposition manifests into an actual outcome is markedly reduced, markedly reduced. Genetics probably accounts for about 20% of, of the risk, which means 80% you have control over.